married men commit suicide at a higher rate in our society. A married man lives his life supporting his wife and children when he faces an abuse. We, as a society, are indifferent to him. He's lying. Men are stronger. He must have abused her. He probably deserved it. It's a rare scenario. A man is severely assaulted by his wife or girlfriend every 14.6 seconds. When a man is battered by his spouse, there is no shelter which would take him. The government which should protect him will imprison him, even if he is falsely accused by his wife. He will lose his job, and will be subjected to social shame. Family courts incentivizes his abuser, by extorting money from him. Divorce alienates him from his children, takes away his house and his money. A man who has lost his children, house, and social image, receives new help from the same government, which he pays tax to. All this helplessness leads to drug and alcohol abuse, which also makes him depressed and suicidal. This is a global phenomenon. Lists of various suicide statistics per year of men, which far exceeds women's rates. America. India. Australia. Canada. Lithuania. Russia. United Kingdom. So many men kill themselves every year. What are we doing about it? Men's rights, Men's rights, rights are, are, are human rights. Human rights. Brought to you by Cyber Saint.